Man, just explain to us how, you know, how, what do you think was the, the secret ingredient for you to, to get to this point? Well, first thing is that I took the advice you gave whole, whole, wholeheartedly. For example, before I joined Al-Andalus, I, 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 I tried to start Arabic three times and I stopped each time, mm -hmm. you know? I mean, one, one time I'm like, okay, it's enough. I have to learn Arabic language. I picked up a random book with vocabulary out of a context, it wasn't in context. I memorized everything, like the, the body parts. So I went to my teacher and I told my teacher, hey, I, I learned a hundred words. And she told me, okay, tell me how to say I could go to the bathroom. I told her, I don't know how to say that, but I can say hand and leg, you know? Mm -hmm. I didn't know what verbs were and nouns were and what heck that. So, you know, I make the eyes, Allah makes Arabic easy for me. And I stumbled upon your, um, your videos and watched your um, presentation and I joined. So when I joined, I try to do things people don't do so I can reach a, a level that people are not at, mm -hmm. you know? So when I did the lessons, I, I repeated the words more than I should have repeated it. I repeated it until I never got it wrong again. And I'll even write it over and over and over again until my hand got familiarized with it at the beginning. And then like after I finished book one, even I wouldn't stick to the program only as well. I would do my outside reading. I would listen to audios over and over again. I have an Instagram page where I actually translate the Alama sometimes. I get videos and I translate to English. I send to my Arab friends. Maybe they can make sure that I make no mistakes. And I make sure I'm in the language. I go to my masjid. It's Arab. I speak with them. I say no English. Mm -hmm. and when I'm traveling, I say no. I try to make myself immersed as much as possible, you know. To the point when I pick up an English book, I open it the wrong way, mm -hmm. you know. No. So I'm just, I'm like, wow. and it's weird to open an English book because I read more Arabic than I read English, you no. know. So I think if in, in a lot of things that students they don't really take uh, heed of is memorizing. It's not fun to memorize, yeah. but when you reach at the end, it's fun, you know, because mm. you memorize word here, word here, and they all they don't they don't make any sense. But then when, when they come into a sentence, it makes sense, you know? Mm. So people, they don't, want to, they, they don't want the easy path, but they want to reach the end, to be no. a sheikh or speaking, you know, clear with balagha. When they came mm. and ask for a cup of water, you know? Oh. So I think people don't have the health to learn Arabic language. No, no alhamdulillah, man. Wallahi, that's, uh, that's literally the difference that, what makes the difference in students, like if I look at all the students that actually had results, they always like this. They always have the mentality of consistency. They know how to listen and they have an empty cup as well. They don't come into the program thinking, oh, well, me, I already know this. So I'm just going to do this. And then I'm not going to do this because I, already, I don't need to memorize that much because this and that. Yeah. And what happens is that mm -hmm. then you don't get the results because you don't listen to, to your instructors. And there's so, actually uh, one thing I did. One quick thing. Like when I memorize the words and I go out and I hear those words being used, but it took me a while to connect the meaning. Mm -hmm. I knew my heft was da'if and I go back to muraja. Mm -hmm. Because like Quran, if you, if you have ayat and you take a while to get the surah, it means surah is weak. Mm -hmm. So if I hear someone say a sentence and I couldn't, Digest it quick enough. That means the word in that sentence, I have not memorized it correctly. Mm. So that's just a big um, advice I would give. Yeah. No. Um, alhamdulillah, Muzammil, may Allah put the barakah in your progress. You know, it's been 827 days since you joined. Really? I yeah. And I've been kind of on and off. If I was the whole nah. way through, I would have been a, probably more fluent. No, nah, definitely. What lesson you have you on version number two? Until what lesson did you... The, Thing is that I'm supposed to start book mm. three, but I I, re I read book four, book one, um, four times, mm. and I'm doing book two for my third time. I'm making sure I don't have a single word slip by me before mm. I start the next books because that is, is more of mastering the little words you have than going by a lot of words and mm. not understanding all of them, you know. So I'll make sure I'm going slow. No, 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 no.